Hey guys, Dark Steel here, and today I'm so excited to be doing this video. I will be unboxing, testing, and reviewing Vaunt Blaze LED flashlights. Uh, and at the end of this video, I will also be announcing the details of a big giveaway, so stay tuned for that. Uh, let's get straight into this. I, uh, there's a few things I want to discuss about this before I go into unboxing it. First off, we're going to read the package. Uh, so it says that batteries are not included, which went ahead and took care of that. Where are they? <laughs> Okay, so, uh, first thing it says on here, it says it requires three AAA batteries, which I went ahead and took care of that. Uh, it says not included, so I, I went and got some. It says waterproof level IP44. Now, what this means is that it's not actually technically waterproof, but splashproof. Uh, and so today we're going to be testing their claims to see if this is a product worth using. It says on the website that they've tested it by submerging it in water but I'm not going to go so far because their claim actually is only that it's water resistant, that it's uh, that it's uh, splash proof. And so I'm going to go ahead and soak it with the sprayer on my kitchen sink and go from there. Uh, it says it's shock proof. It says 200 lumens and that its lifespan is up to nine hours per new batteries. Uh, and of course, you know, that's a variable since we're using outside batteries that can't be entirely sure what the life expectancy of your batteries are if you're buying cheap or whatever it might not it might not uh, work out so we're not going to judge them on that regardless uh let's go ahead and get this open so nice box uh, just blaze okay let's get this out of the package that's awesome so far got here is the battery protectors for the the that's a different kind of battery than the AAA. We've got one flashlight in a case which I actually didn't realize it was going to be coming in cases at first so that's cool. Uh, and two. So that's this is a kit a set of two flashlights. Let's move on from there. Let's give this just open that up. It's a nice case. Lovely flashlight looks good let's go ahead and pop those batteries in which means we're gonna have to open the batteries too bottom unscrews where we reveal the battery compartment I want to check yep it's like there's a rubber ring around the uh, rubber gasket around the um, screw in spot which is going to help for the water resistance oh it immediately woof it immediately came on whenever I just tried to put the batteries in. Okay, and it's flashing. That's one of the settings. Let's shut that off for a minute. Okay, so there we go. Very cool. Okay, so I figured this out. That's awesome. This thing is bright. I I mean, where did I go? Okay. Also, it's got a zoom. Let's see. I'm trying to figure out how to do this on camera. It's got a uh, zoom on there that narrows the view down into a single beam or widens it way out. So this is lovely. I've had a flashlight like this before and I really, really enjoyed it. The difference is that the brand that I was using at the time was cheaply made. I could feel that it was cheaply made. Uh, it had like a little ratcheting thing right here and everything. And at a certain point, just just carrying it around, uh, it popped apart. It was like it spring-loaded and the top just came right off. This one feels like it's much more substantially made, which, yes, I'm going to go ahead and do this. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to mess this up if I can because I want to tell you guys... Uh, for sure, I want to be solid in that this is a good flashlight, and it, it really does seem to be so far. So let's take it inside for further testing. Okay, guys, I'm a little bit nervous about this. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and give this a shot, and let's see if it still maintains functionality. Now, what I'm about to do is totally abuse. 
but if it can hold up to this, then it can hold up to, you know, walking through the sprinklers or, or it raining or whatever. You, it's, it should be fairly water resistant. It looks like it's pretty well sealed. So let's go ahead and just give it a little try. I'm going to just run water. Spray the hell out of it. Here we go. All right, and now we'll look at it. It's completely soaked. Working just fine. No problems whatsoever. I am very happy about that because seriously, I was a little nervous. I, I uh, was told to just kind of do whatever video I wanted to do on this, and I felt like I was going to be a real jerk about it. All right, let's move on. Okay, so a couple of things that I noticed, um, and of course, of course, as I already mentioned, this is not what they intended for you to do with these flashlights. You are not supposed to set it, set it in your kitchen sink and soak it. I was going ridiculous to show that it could take it, or if it could take it, and still functional, still working properly. Having that said, because I soaked it from all angles, because I was spraying it, there's little tiny bits of water in underneath the lens and in on the LED. So gonna wipe those off real quick and that's no harm no foul and uh, of course I won't be doing that again uh, but I'm willing to sacrifice the stuff that is sent to me to test it for quality so that you guys don't end up sacrificing it on accident doing something silly like you know putting it in your sink and spraying it off uh, so there's that but I still say quality item because as I mentioned this is not what they had in mind I'm sure when they s said on there that it has that uh, water resistance because that's not normal use. So that's cool. The other thing is that earlier in the video, I was um, twisting it, trying to telescope it and was like, hmm, I guess it's doing something, but I'm in a tight room, so I'm not noticing. No, my, as I mentioned, I had another flashlight that had kind of a ratcheting little twisting telescoping thing. This one slides out and slides back in. So that one, that was, that was a mistake on me and now I have uh, fixed that one. And yes, it does, it does something pretty cool. It's uh, that zooms in and out quite nicely. I could play with this all day. Okay, anyway, uh, and I probably will. Uh, anyway, let's move on with the video. That's really the only test I could come up with on this particular flashlight, primarily because I don't really have a setup for a lot of uh, more scientific tests. I would like to test exactly how bright it is. Uh, I'm not entirely sure how I would do that. Uh, I don't know if it's displaying very well, but it's very bright. <laughs> uh, but I love the different settings on it. It says uh, that this... The sa this is the same five tactical light settings that the U.S. Special Forces use. It's got SOS, low, medium, high, and strobe, and that it's a fully adjustable beam width, which I went over all of those in this video so far. Uh, really sturdy. I mean, it's heavy, but in a good way. It's, uh, it's, you can tell just by feeling it, it feels like just a, a solid chunk of metal, like very sturdy feeling. Uh, holds up to the water test. I don't know what else to say about it, except go check it out. There's more details on their website. I will put the link in the description. And now it's time to talk about the exciting part about this entire thing. If you want to try out these flashlights for yourself, then I'm going to give you an opportunity. Actually, I'm going to give you two opportunities. One is that I'm going to be giving away a set of these flashlights to one of my subscribers when I hit 500 subscribers. We've only got a little bit to go, so you can do your part in this by sharing this video. And then typing in the comments, vaunt. I want to say the word vaunt in the, in the comments. And that's how you get an entry to win. But if you don't win, by following the link that I've got in the description and using the coupon code D10STEEL, I'll have it up here on the screen, D10STEEL gets you 10% off any vaunt product. That's any vaunt product. So go check out their products, go read for yourself, go look at their stuff. This is awesome. I have already, I've tried this out. I'm going to use this as my new flashlight. I'm going to carry it around on me. 
So excited to have it. Thank you very much to Vaunt for this. Please check the description of this video for uh, further details on the giveaway. It only counts within the U.S., so uh, so no entries outside of the U.S. will be accepted. Uh, and I'm sorry about that, but them's the rules. And uh, that's that's about it. Thank you so much for watching. Let me know in the comments what you think of this video. Hit that like button if you like it. Hit that dislike button if you dislike it. Um, hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. And please, let's go out and get this thing going. Let's uh, let's make this giveaway happen because I would love to see one of these sent out to one of my subscribers. Let's let's do this. All right. Bye.